It was a packed house tonight at the South Knox School Board meeting. Board members discussed the future of the superintendent of the corporation. Newsom Bureau Chief Nathan Springfield was at that meeting. He tells us what the board decided. The South Knox School Corporation is now beginning its search for a new superintendent. Today, I hang my head in shame. Shame to be at this meeting. Shame that this meeting is occurring at all. Shame that this issue was taken so far as to oust a man from his job. In a four to one vote, the school board approved the buyout of South Knox Superintendent Tim Groves' contract. Teachers at the corporation wore black in support of the superintendent and stood outside to greet board members when they arrived. Once the meeting started, both parents and teachers expressed their opinions. Many are still unsure what exactly led to the buyout of Superintendent Groves' contract. We understand that some information needs to be kept confidential. But nothing was told to the teachers and staff about any concerns from the board in regards to the job performance of the superintendent, Mr. Grove. I asked school board members after the meeting what prompted the buyout of Mr. Groves' contract, but all declined to comment. The parents and teachers that I spoke with declined to go on camera, but Our said they believe the school board is retaliating against Grove for attempting to discipline South Knox basketball coach David Burkett. Grove attempted to suspend him for an alleged incident at a varsity basketball game. Again, we should stress the board did not confirm these claims at the meeting. However, a school board member did make reference to an incident at the beginning of the meeting. Tim, I would like to apologize to you on the way you've been treated the last few weeks. What started out with an incident that happened with our varsity boys basketball coach that was addressed but not followed through ended up coming back on you. As board members began revealing their decision, some in the crowd began booing and expressing disappointment. Now you can read a copy of Superintendent Tim Groves' statement and share your opinion on the ruling by heading over to WTHITV.com. Reporting in Vincennes, Nathan Springfield, News 10.